In this lecture series, up to now, we have discussed many of the theory aspects with regards to statistics. Here onwards, we will be talking about different practical applications of statistics, especially with regards to hypothesis testing. Today, we will discuss about the categorization and different types of basic hypothesis testing, statistical tests. This is really important aspect, one of the major reasons behind the statement. Statistics is difficult or we can't understand statistics. The reason is not having basic understanding about these tests. I will introduce some of the basic statistical tests in this lecture. Okay, in hypothesis testing, basically we are testing whether variables are associated or whether there is a difference between the variables. Okay, we can divide this into major two aspects as I mentioned. Hypothesis of association Hypothesis of difference What do you mean by association? In association, if we think about two variables Basically, we can think about two variables Okay, We can concern about the amount of salt that you consume per month and the blood pressure. How do we test this thing? In order to test, we can plot these two variables. What are the two variables? Salt consumption and hypertension. We can plot them in two axes. X axis and Y axis. We can plot the salt consumption here and blood pressure in the Y axis. You can take many individuals, many individuals. You can plot the average monthly consumption of salt in the x-axis and blood pressure against the salt consumption in this graph. So you will get something like this. If you get some a common line within this graph, you can say that this is associated because when you increase the salt consumption, according to this graph, we can identify that blood pressure is increasing. What are the statistical tests that we can use to test the associations? One is R test. We call this as Pearson R. We call this in broad term correlation coefficient we will discuss about correlation coefficient or r test in detail in another lecture another method statistical method that we can use is regression regression is also used to test this kind of hypothesis there are so many regression techniques like simple linear regression Multiple linear regression, non-linear regression. There are so many different types of regressions. We will be discussing most of these things in separate lectures. But under basic statistics, we will be discussing the simple linear regression and correlation coefficient. Next, we can discuss about hypothesis of difference. What do you mean by difference? When you are talking about this difference, we can think about two aspects. One is difference of proportions. What do you mean by the difference of proportions? You are testing whether the smokers are higher in community A or in community B. So we have two communities, A and B. And we can take the proportions like 56% in population A 
and 44% in population B whether there is a significant difference between the smokers proportion of population A versus population B that is what is mean by the difference proportions but here we are not testing the difference we are testing whether there is association whether there is an association here we are testing whether there is a difference what are the tests available to test the significant difference between the proportions one is chi-square test this is one of the most common statistical tests that we are using to test the difference between proportions also we have some other tests based on the different methods that we are testing like McNimas test Cochrane Q test and many other tests that we can list available test for to test the hypothesis in relation to difference of proportions the other type of difference is the difference between means we discussed this in the previous lecture whether the mean birth weight of HIV group birth weight mean is different from normal birth weight mean so you can calculate the mean of this group and the mean of this group and you can test whether there is a significant difference between the two means we call that hypothesis of difference means what are the tests available for to test this kind of hypothesis we have Z test T test ANOVA and many other tests that you can list in this category during this basic statistics lecture I will be discussing about chi-square test Z test T test and ANOVA I hope you are clear about the different statistical tests that we can apply to test for hypothesis testing for associations R test regression for difference especially for proportions chi-square test and for means we have wizard test t test and ANOVA we will be discussing all these tests one by one in the next few lectures thank you very much